Hello YouTube, you're watching Daily Dinkus. It is July 11th, Simplicity Day. That's why you're looking at a simple background and hearing a simple voice of a simple man with a simple plan. And that plan is to jump in a swimming pool. Now I'm here in Paris, France, and I know there are swimming pools, but I want to visit the Eiffel Tower today. And I know from past experience that there is a fountain near the Eiffel Tower that I think I could jump in and call a swimming pool. That would be much simpler. So my plan is just head through the Eiffel Tower, find a fountain, jump in it, splash around, call it a swimming pool, call it a day, and head home. What could be simpler than that? So I've just left Trocadero Station and that right there is the Eiffel Tower. Normally I'd be able to pass through here, but they're shooting something for Mission Impossible Fallout. Damn you, Tom Cruise. Yeah, apparently uh, accessing the tower directly is a Mission Impossible in itself, so I've got to walk around this way. So this is both kind of cool and very annoying, but we'll get there. I just walked around the theater. I'm at sort of the back side of it now. And behind me is the Eiffel Tower. Actually on Simplicity Day, it's a good place to visit because it's actually quite a simple, elegant design. And I, you can actually see the Eiffel Tower from all over Paris. And there's a funny story about an author. I think it was Guy de Maupassant. And he used to dine in the restaurant every day. And he explained that it was because it was the only place in Paris where you couldn't see the damn thing. He was not a fan, I think he called it a monstrosity. The Eiffel Tower was actually supposed to be a temporary exhibit and uh, the majority of the people liked it so much that they kept it. And one last tidbit, Eiffel himself kept a little airy, a little secret apartment upstairs in the very top where he had his assignations with secret lovers, I believe. It is the city of romance and a symbol of romance. And uh, I'll just leave it at that. Yeah, they made it baby simplicity day, but this place is overrun with tourists and it is not simple to get here without interrupting people's photos and... Those buildings there are the backside of the theater. So instead of just walking directly down there to the Eiffel Tower, which is behind us here, I had to walk all the way down here and now I've got to walk around these barriers and finally, in an hour, I'll be at the Eiffel Tower. Happy Simplicity Day, France. We finally arrived at the Eiffel Tower. Last time I was here, this place was overrun with gypsies. Now it's overrun with people selling Eiffel Towers. <laughs> They're everywhere. It's simplicity day and I don't want to clutter up my life. On this day, it's simplicity. I'm trying to live a simpler, minimalist lifestyle. You know what I mean? No, I'm peu. It's simpler not to learn French. On simplicity day, I'm just speaking English. Sorry, man, it's simpler for me. Have a good day. This is all cordoned off. I don't get it. Is it closed for business? Is it because of the Tom Cruise movie? Like, is he base jumping off this thing or what? What the hell is up with this country? So now I'm on another side of the Eiffel Tower. Trying to get to these fountains is impossible. I think I've got to walk parallel to the park, which is over here. And then cut in down here somewhere. Again, this is as not simple as it could possibly be. How ironic is that? If there's no irony day, I'm gonna make it. Which fits with the Eiffel Tower, which is made of iron. How cool is that? It's a French YouTuber. Hey, uh, are you a YouTuber? YouTuber, Periscoper, uh, Facebooker. And you? You, moi aussi? Toi aussi? Yeah. This is Twitter Live, Periscope. Excellent, okay. I'm Daily Dinkus. Daily Dinkus? Yes, I'm here for World Simplicity Day and I'm gonna swimming. It's a swimming pool day. I'm gonna go swim in the fountain near the Eiffel Tower. Okay. Yeah, hopefully I won't get arrested. <laughs> Wish me luck. Good Bye, luck. guys. 
So my recollection from last time I was in Paris is that there are fountains here somewhere. That was my whole premise was that I'd come here and swim in the fountains for swimming pool day. And now I can't find them. I'm gonna ask these guys. Hey, bonjour. Bonjour. Uh, je cherche fontaine. Uh, ah, okay. I think this is just. So this guy is saying I have to no, go I back exactly where I just was. Okay. It's okay. So yeah, apparently I need to go back the way I came. At the Trocadero is where the fountains are. So yeah, I'm a dinkus. So there's the Eiffel Tower again and my plan has completely changed because apparently the fountains at Trocadero are closed. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm looking for water. I need a, a fountain to swim in. <laughs> okay. Uh... <laughs> C'est loin, faut que tu prennes le métro. I can go in the metro. Yes, if it's fast, metro. what's the fastest way? Uh, what's, what's the simplest way? Okay, so you take the metro, 6th, and you take the, the one, and you stop to um, Palais Royal. Palais Royal, and there is a fountain. Wow. Is it illegal to swim? Ah, uh, no. I'm allowed? No. Yes, yeah, just uh, for drink. You can drink? But, uh, you, can, you can swim. What if I swim anyway? Uh, in the swimming pool. No, in the fountain. It's okay. I'm allowed because ah, I'm an idiot. So, so I'm just crossing the bridge on the way to the metro station over there. These are the Bateau Mouche. And what could be simpler on Simplicity Day than taking a leisurely ride on a river craft? So we're here. And then I am. And I am hot. It is boiling with 5,000 people in the subway car. Not much air conditioning, so a swim would be nice right now. And look at my feet. Look at that. It's from walking through all the dusty paths over by the Eiffel Tower. You swear? So yes. Okay, and you you have a, you, you are in the park in the park. Before. And there are fountains. So you yeah. could say it's simple to get there. Yeah, it's, it's, it's open. You can Perfect. See. Simple. Okay. Mm -hmm. Simple. Facile. Facile. Très simple. Thank you. Five minutes. So this is the Palais Royal and we'll see if there is a garden and lo and behold there is in fact a park back here amazing we were in the park and that thing right there is a fountain it's going to be tricky to get in there though at the Trocadero, there's a lot more space. It's wide open. This is like a proper fountain. I don't know if I'm going to be able to swim in there. This is going to take balls of steel. Preferably stainless steel that doesn't rust. And there's nowhere to sit except for one spot. It's almost like the fates telling me, yes, you are destined to sit in this chair and jump in that fountain right there. So I'm gonna jump in really quick because otherwise people are gonna maybe tell me that I'm not allowed to. I have to play like a dumb tourist. There are a million people around, so uh, this is a little crazy. I'm a little apprehensive. Here we go. I almost forgot, I've gotta put on my bathing cap because it's Respect Canada Day on the 15th. So I'm gonna put that on for you guys. How's that? I also forgot to bring my towel. Anyway, here we go. <laughs> so I'm swimming in the fountain. <laughs> oh my god, it's cold! <laughs> All right, that's actually quite refreshing and I forgot a towel so I'm just gonna air dry. 
and no one's called the police. <laughs> What's up? Uh, well, we're just wondering why you were like swimming in the Because it's swimming pool day. Okay. Yeah, I'm a YouTuber. Okay, well, I, I guess from the camera that you were vlogging, but... <laughs> you want to come in for a dip? Uh, no, I, we have to catch a play after. <laughs> and that's the only reason. And look at the water, it's a little bit... I don't know how you say in French, disgusting? Uh, Dégoutant. Dégoutant? Dégoutant. Like, goût means to eat, uh, so you wouldn't... Goûter is uh, to eat, right? So you wouldn't eat this water? No, yeah. I wouldn't drink it. No, no, no. me neither. <laughs> yeah, so you enjoyed my little show. I think everyone enjoyed your little show, to be honest. <laughs> See? Yeah, we celebrated our 150th anniversary last year. So you're from Canada? I am. I'm hoping people will think I'm American though, so I guess I should hide that. <laughs> Give Americans a bad reputation. America! Go America! <laughs> you should have a bathing suit with Yes, I know. Next year, I'll be back. I know some of you will give me flack about this not being a swimming pool, but it's a pool of water and I swam in it. Therefore, it's a swimming pool, no? I think so. <laughs> that was fun. Uh, till next time you're watching Daily Dinkus. Happy Swimming Pool Day. Happy Respect Canada Day. Happy Simplicity Day. I'm Daily Dinkus. Bye now. She told me I have to get dressed. Yeah. Oh, really? Why? Yeah. I'm, I'm in... That can't be the right, can't be true. No, no, it's actually forbidden in the public places in Paris. To have your shirt off? Yeah, yeah. Really? 